How did you know this? I didn't know at all. I found it a natural game of language. If it's quite all right, I need you, baby, to warm the lonely night. I love you, baby. Trust in me when I say, when I say, Clint Eastwood is bringing to the big screen Jersey Boys. Broadway loves it. You are going to love it. Oh, what a night. And let me love you, baby. Let me love you. Let's talk to the stars. The 60s had this, this vibrant energy. There was an essence to it. It was a real transitional time in our history. And I think the music captured that blue collar, coming of age, restlessness with love and life and kind of breaking through, breaking out. And it really captured it. And here we are, you know, 50 years later still still singing it. And you listen to the Beach Boys and you can sort of smell the salt air and, and feel the sand under your feet. You listen to the Four Seasons and you can hear the car horns blaring at an intersection, you know, you know, in downtown Newark. It's like, it's, there's, there's a real feeling of the East Coast in that music and, and I think it transports people back who used to, you know, who were, who were kids then. And for a new generation, sort of, it's, it gives them a sense of what it really is and was to be an East Coast American. Story. I'm the one you want to talk to, Tommy DeVito. If it wasn't for me, we all would have wound up with a bullet in our head. Friends like that, you should change your name to Sinatra. I'm going to be as big as Sinatra. I would love to introduce you to a new discovery of mine, Frankie Valli. I heard them all, but I never heard a voice like Frankie Valli's. I know I need to write for this voice. <laughs> you know, these songs are just, they're just infectious. And when we sing them, I mean, in the stage production, which was what was always so great was to look out into the crowd and to see people getting up, dancing, see couples grabbing hands and holding hands during the love songs. Um, it is, these songs mean a lot to people of all generations. I mean, my dad knew these songs the first time around. I listened, you know, Oh What a Night was in every bar mitzvah I ever went to. <laughs> so these songs have been around forever and they truly are the soundtrack to people's lives. People remember very distinctly where they heard Cherry for the first time or whatever that song is for them. And I mean, people have come up to me and said, you know, my name was not even Cherry, something that sounds like Cherry, but that song, John. Meant, it was John, <laughs> but, but Cherry, Cherry, but is, Cherry is, is, is my, you know, and so it's really interesting. People bring a lot of history with these tunes and that's such a, that's such a cool thing. Yeah. Cherry, is that a different sound? I love this record. We do everything together. How old are you? Together or separately? Big girls. We got a little success now. The records, the TV, the personal appearances. Now, both of you, this is your first major motion picture. Clint Eastwood. I know. We started at the top. Are we really, it's, it's all down here. <laughs> <laughs> it really is. <laughs> yeah, it's. Listen, we both we both still are every day. Like this morning, we walked in to do all of this, and we're both like, "What? How did we get? We're both ready to work at Starbucks tomorrow." You have to realize <laughs> we come from the theater world. You really are always chasing your next paycheck, mm -hmm. and you never think that Hollywood is interested in theater actors or actors who are on stage, there's this little bit of this, you know, thing about that. But what was so wonderful for us for working with Clint is that he specifically wanted to use people that did it, not for any other reason other than they were the best person for the job. You're just too good to be true. Tommy's in a little trouble. What is a nice thing? Can't take my eyes. The fact is, the trouble started long before that. You'd be like heaven. You got the voice, I got the songs. We make a partnership. I think Frankie would have cut Tommy loose right then. That's what you think? You're not from Jersey. Can't take my eyes off of you. Frankie, this is your time. Who loves you, pretty baby? Who's gonna help? Hey, 
Chester, what was the high point? The four guys under a street lamp. First time we made that sound, our sound. That was the best. Ladies and gentlemen, the more season! I love you, baby. Well, you are going to be singing this all night long after you see Jersey Boys. So be sure to look for this in your real-time theater. Trust in me when I say... Thank <laughs> you.